Welcome back to more Pokemon Fire Red. So on the last episode, we arrived at the Mount Moon and we almost got like 25% done. In this episode, we are probably gonna get more of, of things done here. I should have probably bought more repels off camera, but yeah, I still left only two repels now. Anyway, moving on to this place and battling this trainer right here. Okay, Green Tiger level 18. Now I need to switch to... Talks, uh, speedy. Um, so you, what is this? Oh yes, TM46 Thief. All it does, it's it apparently steals the um, holding item of the foe. Um, I don't think it's that useful though. And you also got the ether right there, like I showed you. Um, so getting out of that place and battling this trainer right here. Okay, you can call that an annoying battle because Fury Attack missed all the time, but once it hit it probably knocked out everyone but yeah speedy now level 17 um, and very low on health apparently on the yellows and I'm gonna switch to green tie um, toxic and because next uh, next trainer coming up is a hiker and uses onyx so oh wow, you shocked me oh you're just a kid all right done with that and now toxic is level 17 yeah so you gotta go back with Speedy here and let me grab that item here and repel we're off. So Tia uh, found Moonstone. For Moonstone evolves the fairy. Oh, as I was saying, Moonstone evolves the fairy, Jigglypuff, Nido Ran Nido Rena, Nido Nido Rena and what what is our called? Yeah, Nido Rena and uh, all into I'm so confused here. Okay. And uh, now I'm um, out of confusion. Oh God. Okay, so Moonstone, as I said, evolves Jigglypuff, Clefairy, and Nidorinas. Nidorina, uh, I'm not gonna evolve mine right now. I'm gonna evolve mine way later, when once it goes into the 30s and 32s. Not now. It would be a wise choice to evolve it only later. If you evolve it right now, it's gonna work against you. So, yeah, I kinda need to watch out on your moves about that. So anyway, moving on, um, yeah, let me, can you walk? Yeah, if you run past this, he'll probably see you, but I want him to see me, so. Little kids shouldn't be messing around with grown-ups. It could be bad news. You, you don't even look like a grown-up. I am so sick of Fury Attack missing all the time, so now I started using Peck, even though Fury Attack is a way worse attack, but still, anyway, moving on. And, Repel's effect wore off. So anyway, sprayed my last repel and walked into this battle. Teams Rocket Shell find the fossil. Let's see Pokemon from them will earn us huge riches. Alright, Speedy is almost about to be dead because again I started using Peg now Peg starts missing. So I'm gonna go with the green to no Toxicin because next trainer coming up uh uses coughing and grimer. So coughing is more of offensive and I mean more defensive and Grimer is more special defensive that's the difference between them uh, b both of them are great Pokemon you can cast them later later in the game so let's battle this trainer hey stop I found these fossils they're both mine so I'm gonna not gonna skip these battle because I forgot to so sorry for that and you got Toxicin coming in and let's go on Peck here Oh, did you get the I'm not going to use the deer, just in case. And, okay, so it was not that much of an important move anyway, but... Heck, should you do more damage now? Yeah! Avoid using special attacks on Grimer, just to let you know. Oh my god, he is on here. And, uh, just like, like I was saying, avoid using special attacks on Grimer, because it's probably can take him for a long while, because it's very, very special defensive. And you should avoid using physical attacks and talk, um, coughing mostly, but um, at this time of the game, most of the Pokemon is only the physical attacks of your first three starters. And you got double kick. And charge what basically does is charges um, electrical power for your next electric move. Later it will be useful if you know how to use it. And double kick. And as the name states, it's only, it will only hit two times. And Toxicant is holding on pretty well for now, but I think it's going to have some trouble once coughing steps into the playground. And, and that's it for Voltorb. None of them did that much damage. 
and you got coughing. Here comes the pain in the butt. Okay, Super Nerd Miguel sent out coughing. Coughing is super defensive. I mean, super defensive. I'm gonna raise my critical hit ratios, lower its defenses. Then only will I attack him. And this mug is not gonna do anything to me. Yay! It don't did one damage. So I'm gonna use double kick. And it's not very effective. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Anyway, we got a quick hit. So it's uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna use smog again. Yeah, and it's probably gonna lower us down to 32. Hopefully, yes, 32. I know it didn't do any more damage. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, critical hit. Yeah, finally. So Toxic is grace 292 experience and is level 18. Trying to learn poison saying. Nope, um, if, uh, yeah, you should not teach a poison thing because it's already a weak move. Yeah, but it has the chance of poisoning your bow, though, so it de really depends on you if you want to use it. So he said he can take one of his, um, fossils. Um, one of them is, uh, Kabuto and the other is Omanite. Um, I forgot which one, I think the Dom fossil was Omanite, uh, and the Helix fossil was, um, Kabuto. And Kabut uh, Kabuto is more def uh, Offensive and Omanyte is more defensive, but at the long run, I prefer Kabutops, which is evolved from a Kabuto more than Omastops, which is evolved from Omanyte. So, after we are out of this place and the repel were off, and wait, I forgot to show you one thing. These people right here will teach you Mega Punch and Mega Kick. I wanna go ahead and teach Mega Punch to my um, one and only Toxkint. Oh, Toxkint is not able to learn Mega Punch. So, I, I do not know that. So if you have, um, like, um, someone like Charmeleon and someone like, uh, Waterfall, you can teach it. So, after that is done, you end to get this item right here, which is a TM5 Roar, which basically makes your Pokemon run away. Makes one Pokemon run away and makes trainer Pokemon switch out. So we're here at Cerulean City. First thing you want to do off the bat is you want to go to this house, go all the way back to the house, go to this flower and press A down here and you get one rare candy. Um, a lot of people don't know that but I knew, knew it by accident when I was going crazy over that place as a kid. And here we go. And this is the gym of Cerulean, and in the next episode we're going to be covering that gym, so I'll be seeing you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.